Okay, this is Carmen 107 from Catullus, and uh, it's a pretty happy poem. And uh, Catullus is excited that Lesbia, I guess, has, for the time being, returned to him, and uh, and all is bright in Catullus's world. Um, as we've seen a couple times before, he frames his feelings um, in the perspective of you know all feelings ever, <laughs> and so you get in the first couple lines this very indefinite uh, quit qualm means anything. So it's the neuter version of quist qualm. And then you get another word ever. Um, and so let, let's take a look here. We got some dative's cupido, optanti, and then inspiranti. Okay, so if anything to a person uh, desiring and or maybe eager is better for Cupido and desiring ever happens so up to get is this impersonal highlighted by the quick quong so if anything ever happens to a man eager and uh, or desiring and eager or something like that and then on the next line we get an enjambment here this means not hoping for it so if anything ever happens to someone desiring and eager, and there's almost like a but, but not hoping for it. Now, hulk is long. This O is long, but it is nominative. He's saying, well, this, i.e. this situation, this anything, is, is, is propria, is truly pleasing to the soul. It's truly, truly pleasing to the mind. Therefore, this thing, and now we're going to get to what this thing is here, down here. Truly, this is pleasing to us and, and dearer than gold, more precious than gold. The fact that you, Lesbia, are bringing yourself back to me desiring you okay so the fact that you lesbian are bringing yourself back this <clears throat> is pleasing to us and it's more precious than gold and he repeats the race did to us he's so overjoyed you are bringing yourself back to to me eager and 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 not expecting it not hoping for it you yourself are bringing yourself back to us, to me. Oh, and this takes a little bit of explanation. Oh, light, and as we've seen, light can stand for day. Oh, what a day, basically, Catullus is saying. And then we have this ablative of, of uh, description maybe here, with a brighter mark. So the Romans used to mark propitious days on their calendars with a white stone. And so, honestly, Maybe the best translation here in English is, oh, oh, what a white stone day is essentially what I would translate that as. Oh, what a day with a brighter mark is literally what that is. Who, and we're going to return to all of this indefinite stuff up here. So who lives happier than me alone? Or who, here's Quis Poderit, will ever be able to live a life to be um, to be desired essentially here is the the gerundive uh, who will ever more than anybody else who will who will ever be able to live a life to be desired maybe more than me that's probably what that that magus is doing there 